Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Long time no see. making a really short video for you guys i'm gonna be reviewing drum roll i'm gonna be reviewing the saharan blush volume 2 by juvia's place okay i'm really excited to show you guys this because i actually just got a i got a recommendation from a friend to get it i was kind of confused on the blush to get and of course Juvia has always been my plug to get um, foundation, eyeshadow, concealer, and all that. I got the volume two, so I'm gonna be basically showing you guys the colors, the reveal. So this is the color of the blush. This is the Saharan blush volume two by Juvia's Place. And these are the colors. Different names, Yara, Shola, Tao, Lina, Zoba, B. Okay, so the one that I used today, I used um, Shola and Tao. I don't know if it's Tao or Twa. Tao. It's probably Twa. Tao. Tao. T A U. <laughs> All right, because I love Jovia because of the names that they give their products. It's great. All right, so I used Shola and Twa this morning. I don't know if you guys can see it, but in the next slide, I'm going to be showing you guys what it actually looks like. So, I'm going to be using myself as a guinea pig to basically show you guys the pigmentation and how thick it is and everything like that. Let us start with Twa. So, this is Twa. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's great, right? So, let me just put it right. Perfect. So, you see how it is? That's Twa, that's T-A-U, and this is from the Volume 2 palette, Saharan Blush. That's Twa. I actually used Twa this morning. I used Shola and Twa this morning. I kind of blended them together. I felt like the Twa was not, as you can see, the Twa is, is showing everywhere, right? But on my face, I kind of, I felt like it wasn't doing it for me. So I had to mix Shola. So this is Shola. exactly so i had to mix shola and twa together because i kind of liked um twa but shola has uh, um kind of shimmers glitters ish to it so i was like mm, i don't know but this is shola so this is twa this is shola you can see the clear difference right and so that's why i had to mix them up the other ones i haven't tried them yet but i'm, but I'm gonna obviously show you what they look like so this is yara Yara is kind of like the color of my skin. It, it blends. I'm pretty sure that's not really gonna do much on my face. It's not. It's just gonna. I feel like. I feel like uh, Yara is gonna blend with my skin tone because it's basically my skin, as you can see. It doesn't look. It feels like I'm not even doing nothing, right? So that is Yara. Uh, I wouldn't say I'm a fan of Yara, but I, I, I get it. But I don't. I, I doubt I'm gonna be using Yara because, you know, blush. You want blush to show on your face. You know the aim of putting blush is to show on your face all right so let's try lena so this is lena right here this is Le this is lena wow that's beautiful so this is lena lena is showing pretty well so mm, as of right now shola twa and lena are they are giving what they're supposed to give Yara, not as much. Like I said, Yara is more like my skin tone and blush. You kind of want blush to show. Blush is like that concealer. You know, blush is like concealer. You want concealer to show when it's supposed to show. You know what I'm saying? So you can't you can have blush, you know, your, your skin tone. You can't have your skin tone be blush or blush your skin tone, whatever. But yeah, so that's Lena. I'm going to be trying Zoba. So this is Zoba right here. Let's see if Zoba is given. So this is Zoba. I mean, Zoba is 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 there. I, I don't really know. It's, it's kind of giving a metallic kind of color, a metallic kind of look. I don't know if I'm going to ever use Zoba, but let's see. I'm going to be mixing and matching to see which one really, you know, fits my look on a specific day or, you know, if I'm mixing and matching and I'll see which one works. But for right now, Zoba and Yara are not giving what they're supposed to give. The last one is B. Let's see if B is given. 
so this is B. I, I don't know if you guys can see. Yeah, so this is B. B is given, okay? B is given what it's supposed to give. I kind of like that dark purplish color. Can you guys see it? So this is that's B. That's the last one. Like I said, this is the Juvia Saharan Blush Volume 2. I do not have the Volume 1 yet. I wanted to try Volume 2 because when I looked at the Volume 1 and Volume 2, the Volume 2 colors kind of looked great, you know, on picture. And I was like, you know what? Let me get this. The colors look popping. The Volume 1 colors kind of look dull. And um, I decided to go for Volume 2. I definitely will get Volume 1 just to try it out. But this is Volume 2. Like I said, my top four or three are Tao, Shola, Lena, and then B. Zoba and Yara are not necessarily giving what they're supposed to give. Um, Yara is kind of like my skin tone, so I doubt it's going to show. I doubt it's going to pop the way I want it to pop. So Yara is like my skin tone. I don't know if I'm ever going to use it. Zoba is kind of giving a metallic look to it. So I don't necessarily think I'm ever going to use it. But who knows, you know, I may just be feeling frisky and try it one day. But guys, like I said, for the last time, this is the Saharan Blush Volume 2 by Juvia's Place. If you're thinking of blush to get like I was, I was kind of contemplating like, what kind of blush do I get? You know, what, you know, what kind of color do I like? I was kind of confused. And so I asked a friend and she recommended um, Volume 1 and Volume 2 for me from Juvia's Place. So guys, if you are contemplating on getting blush, you want to check out volume two you can check out volume one as well but obviously you can see the pigmentation and everything you know if you're someone that likes something dull and simple and not too out there you can try volume one you know but to be honest with you when you try this out it doesn't really it's not like rah in your face you know you can put it you can put it in moderation you can you know do it however you want to do it but this is it right here guys and so this is it for the review i just wanted to let you guys know that um i found a blush and i hope you guys find yours too Anyways, guys thank you so much for tuning into the video i hope um that helps you guys in making your decision when i want to get volume one or volume two um i'm gonna try as much as possible to do a lot more reviews so you guys just let me know what more uh, you want me to do um and i will think about it and i will uh, bring it to you guys all right thank you so much for tuning into this video if you haven't subscribed yet please please for the love of god i beg you subscribe to my channel i need more subscribers i'm trying to hit 5,000 subscribers or maybe 3,000 and I will celebrate but if you haven't liked the video yet please like let me know what you think in the comment section below we can interact we can talk if you have volume one tell me more about it and you know I would probably get it and try it you know for myself but thank you so much for tuning into this video I will see you next video bye